I think we're going. I think we got this. I think it's going. <laughs> How can you tell we'll if it's going out. or not? <laughs> we'll find out soon. Well, I'm, I'm watching it in another window, so let's see. If, cool. Uh, I think it's going. All right. It see, looks... I see... Yep. Okay. All right. I have Twitch open and it shows the screen that I'm looking at. Yeah. So, all right. Cool. Okay. So, welcome. Step well, one. <laughs> yeah. We got it figured out. Uh, <laughs> hopefully, this will make it go faster in the in the future. Um, but yeah. So this is our uh, the Web of Dreams, Ultimatum of Chaos scenario one play. I am not. I'm looking forward to it, but also not. Like I'm very scared. Mm -hmm. um, so let's <laughs> just get right. That into is that. That is accurate. <laughs> Okay. All right. So Roland and Preston. I don't know what sort of preamble normally happens with these. I'm going to be honest. I don't. I don't watch or listen to our plays. So Ian, I'll let you <laughs> kind of direct everything if you want. Sure. Well, welcome everyone. This is. Uh, we don't really have a title for what this is, but yeah, we're playing the Chaos Run that we mentioned and set up on a recent episode. Where basically all four of us, uh, as hosts on the Mythos Busters, generated a chaos deck um, based on an investigator that the community voted for each of us. In my case, uh, I'm Ian, and I was voted to uh, run a chaos Preston, Preston deck, which is terrible. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Nick over there was uh, one of his favorite investigators, right, Roland? Um, oh, yeah. But this is this is a chaos version, though. So not the Roland that Nick uh, knows and loves necessarily. <laughs> Far from um, it. Yeah, and so we divided up the hosts. We're each taking on a different half of the dream meters. Sean and Scott got started with um, the dreaming side, and so now it's our turn to do the waking side, starting with the waking nightmare scenario. So we'll see how this goes because I think. Uh, everyone can agree that Nick and I got the uh, the bad end of the deal as the far as these end, chaos yeah. decks. Yeah, mm -hmm. <laughs> they're mm -hmm. concerned. They're pretty terrible. So we'll see how this goes. All right, shuffle, shuffle, um, shuffle. I, yep, we can draw our opening hands. See what I got. Mm, okay, get that weakness out of here. Okay, what do I want to keep? None of this. Um, oh my god, that's right. Secret Solution is in this deck. What the fuck? <laughs> I guess I'll keep Knife. Uh, I mean, I really don't know what to do with this de deck in general, so I'm right. not sure like, what, to, what to throw back, really. Um, I think I'm going to throw... I feel like I need to keep curiosity in my opening hand because I don't know when else I will be able to use it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is so <laughs> terrible. Who agreed to this? So I threw back one card. I probably should have threw back more, but it was like I was so worried that I would just draw even worse things. Uh, but I, I ended I ended up with two take hearts, which is good because I plan yes. on failing early and often. <laughs> that is good. Um, I have I have, I, I have a knife. Oh, that's good. We have a weapon. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> a quote unquote a weapon. Yes, because I have no weapon. Um, I also oh. have crack the case, a colt, um, inspiring presence, and run for your life. So. <laughs> I don't know what my first turn is going to look like. We'll see. I have a Trial by Fire, which I kept because I figured that's probably my only way to do some early investigating. Mm. I got a, de a decoy, which I kept in case we have an enemy we can't deal with, we can evade. I have Joey the Rat with no items. <laughs> <laughs> and then I have two Take Hearts. Uh, the other card I drew in my opening hand was a small favor, which I pitched back to get a to see what I could get, and it ended up just being another to take heart. Gotcha. Okay, alright. Yeah. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Do you wanna... Uh, yeah, okay, let's flip this over. Yeah, so 
So the uh, I think the only bit of business as far as the campaign itself is concerned is just choosing whether the good doctor, Dr. Mahas, right. were on whether we're going to take her with us or, or leave her. And I'm voting for taking her with us. Works for me. we need all the help we can get. So I guess we need to decide who's the lead because she goes under the lead investigators. Um, what does she do again? She allows you to parlay... Or no, automatically yeah, evade. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, yep. I feel like that should probably go to you. Okay. Because sure. Because theoretically... I'm going to be able to handle enemies right off the bat. I mean, looking at my hand, probably not, but theoretically, I can. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so we're in the waiting room, which is the resign action. I'm tempted to take that now, but let's at least see how we do. Yeah. <laughs> For my first action, I resign. <laughs> um, if I remember right, the records office is the one that's difficult to to um investigate right i can't remember exactly what the action or what the um ability is on it but i remember that's like a little more action intensive yeah so we probably want to go well you know what let's just get set up here so i'll go ahead and just go first um i have indebted as my weakness uh i'm gonna play my knife <laughs> uh, for yeah one. we need a weapon <laughs> yeah mm -hmm. and then i have my colt as well uh, but I don't know if that's going to be, oh God, this is so garbage. I'm going to draw a card. Draw. Curiosity. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so I guess I could investigate the waiting room. That's a three and I'm three, but curiosity would make me four more cards in hand. It gains one. So I'd be five to three. God, do I want to pitch that this early? I don't know what else I can. I don't know what else I can do. Yeah. And we have to get eight clues for this first stack. God, I better, I better. Okay, we'll pitch <laughs> curiosity. I don't know when else I'm gonna have four cards in hand. So. All right, five to three. Oh joy. Oh zero. That's a zero. Perfect. I drew the elder thing, which is number of infested locations, which there are none. So. Oh no, I don't have I don't have deduction. I don't get both clues. I get just one clue. All right. One out of eight. Oh, we're on our eight. way. That's my turn. Okay. So go ahead. Uh, let me grab my four uh, resources for family inheritance. Oh boy. Okay, I think my first action I'm gonna play Joey the Rat. <laughs> <Because> <laughs> Joey's my boy, even though he has nothing to do in this deck. I think there's like five items total in this deck, and none are in my opening hand. Uh, why am I putting him there? I guess he is a threat <laughs> right now, <laughs> more than anything. Um, I can uh, Inspiring Presence Joey the Rat at some point, because I don't know if I have an ally to target with Inspiring Presence, so... <laughs> sure, but he doesn't even exhaust to use his ability. Oh so. my god, that's right! <laughs> uh... I mean, see, this is the thing with this deck. Like, what the hell else did I do now with one <laughs> and each? It's ridiculous. Um, I can hope for an Elder Sign where I can spend two to automatically succeed. <laughs> or, I, or I can just draw. See, the thing is, uh, so, someone is joking in chat that I have these nice take hearts which are just drawing into more terrible cards. <laughs> <laughs> So I think what I'm going to do is just second action, try to investigate with take heart, and I'm probably going to fail and just draw some cards okay. instead of doing a draw action. Yeah. Uh, all right, let's see what we get. Well, is there anything bad for if you fail? It's not so making it. Yeah, so we're not going to get penalized yet for if I no. fail. Okay. This is the, literally the best time. <laughs> <laughs> Tentacle! <laughs> oh no. I just rub it in my face, Gabe. Thanks. <laughs> okay, draw two cards and two resources. So, the those two resources are going to go on my family inheritance, actually. Which means they're going to be wasted, but... Uh, mm, I do have two trial by fire, so maybe I can do some investigation next turn. Hmm. Uh, okay. 
Okay, I'm just gonna play at the keepsake, I guess, and use Joey's ability, which I can use now. So I'll spend one and play keepsake without having to take an action. And then... What the hell do I do? I'm gonna assume you're probably gonna get this other clue, so I'm gonna try to move to another location so I can maximize my trial by fire next turn. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to remember which one has a lot of clues. I think the therapies ward, or do they have, both have the same? I honestly do. I know the records office has clue, like a lot of clues. I think that's two per, but it, it like I said, it's action intensive to pull from there. Yeah. Um, but yeah, between these two, I can't remember. I remember the, um, the stairs come from the experimental yeah. therapies ward. So maybe I'll just go to the uh, emergency room with my last action. Sure. Knowing I have decoy there in case I need to evade it or something. Okay, so that is just two clues. That's fine. Each of my skill tests gets plus one difficulty for each card committed to it. Joke's on you. <laughs> I'm going to fail anyway. <laughs> okay. And that is my turn. And okay. I lose this resource. So draw one, gain one, T taunt. Yay. Let's see what I get. I get... Intel report. Hey, that's actually nice. useful. My single copy of Intel report. Jeez. <laughs> oh, All right. Um, so there's no text on the agenda. We are at one of two doom. This is already off to a great start. Um, and since I went first, I guess I'll draw from the encounter deck first. So what do I get? I get the suspicious orderly. That's fine. He's a he's an enemy. That's fine. Oh, but I can't fight him. That's ugh. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, I have the doctor, so probably. <laughs> Who made that decision? <laughs> okay, so my card is... Rotting Remains! Okay, <laughs> hello, horror. <laughs> Good thing you dropped um, that, that uh, keepsake. I might as well just commit the take heart to it. See if what I get. So one to three... Now it's one to four, isn't it? Because you're at the oh yeah, yeah, one to four, yeah. So now I'll really fail. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, whatever. Zero to four. Uh, zero to four. Yeah. So that will be um, take out my keepsake, and then one will go on Joey, uh, and then I'll put one on Maha, the doctor, I guess. Mahas were on. Okay, that's the four, and then I draw two and two resources. Okay. Boop. Boop. Okay. Okay, do you want to... Are you interested in trying to peel this suspicious orderly off of me, or are you thinking you're going to have better luck investigating in the emergency room? Um... Let's see. Okay, let me let me take a look at what I have. Um, because I have to be engaged with it, so I'd have to go up, grab it from you. Uh, I could also decoy it, because it can just be straight up evaded, right? It just can't yes. be attacked. Correct. Yeah. Okay, that's also an option. I can decoy it. So that I don't have to go over there. Right. Mm-hmm. So I guess I have to go first, basically, right? Uh, yeah. Either way. Oh wait. Okay. Oh no. Yeah. They. Yeah. You're right. You do. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I get four from inheritance. I had two from the take heart. So um, let's see what I want to. Okay. So first off, I will spend four to do the decoy. At the next location over. Okay. And so that'll take care of that. Evaded. And then. Hmm, how do I want to do this? Just trail by fire it, I guess. So I'll spend one 
two, and then one for my pool, for three for trial by fire. Uh, so I'm going to set my intellect to five, so this is going to be five to two. And I'll okay. do that once. Okay, that's one clue. Nice. Hey, I'm doing something. <laughs> <laughs> We're already doing better than I expected. Five to two. Don't jinx it. <laughs> Five to two. Nice. What is this? Uh, that's minus zero. Okay. So grab those two. And then I'm going to use Joey to and pay one to play the leather coat for free. Nice. Do it, Joey. And then I think for my last action, I play Lone Wolf. Oh, yeah. Very good. I'll just put it in my mystic slot. Okay, that's it. Okay. Um, I guess I'll investigate again, but I'm I'm three to three. I don't really have anything I want to pitch. I forget what allies if I have any in my deck. So I, don't really want <laughs> I don't remember to... either. I know, so I don't really want to pitch either of those. I mean, what harm is there in testing three to three? There's none right now, right? Yeah, there's nothing right now. So three to three. And that's a big no. <laughs> we'll try it again. Three to three. Oh my god. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> Negative four and then tentacle. Uh, do I waste my whole turn doing this? God, we need these clues. I'm, you know what? We're just going to pitch Inspiring Presence. Four to three. Oh god, Jesus. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, that's me. Oh. Uh, I actually should have moved back there so that I could deal with the orderly free instead fine. of playing Lone Wolf. Oh, but... I drew him into hand. That was all right. It's fine. <laughs> this is now a hidden card. Okay, so there's no other enemy business, so draw one. Trench coat? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, small favor. Okay, well, I can do some damage maybe at some point. <laughs> All right, agenda flips. As you continue to explore... We don't need to read the flavor text, right? People know. Well, no, I, we usually don't. Shuffle the set-aside Spider's Encounter set and each set-aside copy of Outbreak into the encounter deck along with the encounter discard pile. Draw the set-aside the Infestation Begins story card and resolve its text. Oh, geez, how do we do an Infestation bag in this? I've never even thought about that. I think it's already set up. It should be in that little oh, treasure perfect. chest, oh, I yep. believe. The Infestation bag. Um, and the Infestation Begins, and we put the Spider's Encounter set into the deck. Flip and outbreak. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Move all of them. Move all of them. There we go. Man, that first agenda is so fast. I know. <laughs> it's like they expect you to actually do something. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just leave it like that. Okay, so the infestation bag's up there. Um, do we need to read the back? Oh no, that's. Yeah, I think it's just the setup of the infest, yeah. infestation bag. Yep. Okay. So, all right. So Is it? Have... Wait. Let me. I'll just double check because I think. First uh, two Oh yeah, we do have to place one damage token on the location with the most clues, so we get an infest <laughs> right away. Sorry, <laughs> I tried real hard to get that last one off of there. <laughs> Our resign is gone. <laughs> <We're trapped. laughs> okay. All right. So now we're just good to continue, right? At the end of the mythos, yeah. Phase, when we do the infestation test. Okay. So yeah. Draw encounter card. Get another suspicious orderly. Nope. Sickening webs. Oh, that's right. That's the one that makes spiders big. Okay, and I'll draw and get. Wait, I thought I clicked on Let's try it again. Oh, damn it. Oh, a glimpse of the underworld. That's fine. I got soaks. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one thing I do have. <laughs> okay, and now um, infestation. Mm -hmm. Do I just click it? No, oh, I got to right click and draw. We'll draw. I drew a cultist. That's not good. 
Ugh. <laughs> Infesting yeah, already. No! Uh, <laughs> so we have to choose one connected, right? Send it north to the right yeah. office. Yeah, let's try to delay it as long as possible. Uh, okay. There. Okay. Okay. <sighs> All right. I still have this <laughs> orderly to deal with. He's still hanging around. Okay, so should I go peel him this time off? Sure. You? <laughs> I think we're going to have to at this point. Yes. Okay. Uh, let me get my resources. I will first deal with this. I'm get going your extra to trigger. one wolf. Oh, yes. Oop. Although I don't know that I'm going to spend it this turn. Um, discard. I'll, I'll trigger the free action to discard a glimpse of the underworld, and I'm going to take one damage and one horror. I'll take one damage on the trench coat, and I'll take one horror on Preston. And then I will move and engage up here, engage the orderly Yay. you, and then I'll trigger the doctor's ability um, to exhaust and automatically evade. Evaded. And then now what do I do? Um, I, I could just intel report this. Yes. Seems the best use of my time. So, although do I want to save it for a time when I can double up on it and discover two mm, clues. That's true, too. <laughs> because I only have one copy. Mm. Yeah, what else am I going to do with my timer? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to waste the travel by fire either. No, one. not for one action. Maybe just draw a card, I think. I'm just going to draw. Sure. Let's see what you get. Hey! A meat cleaver! <laughs> That's I not can bad. Kind of fight. <laughs> uh, if only we could not get really, an enemy we could fight. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, I will investigate. Uh, so the elder thing's a negative one now. Okay. Yeah. And the cultist can trigger another in infestation test. Oh. <laughs> Oh this yeah, is this is good. where we're gonna start getting punched yep. when we get punished for failure. <laughs> so I think I better commit my crack the case. Ah, oh, but is a plus one even gonna do anything? Like, what's the bag composition? <sighs> it's not great. It would at least yeah. it would ne uh, um, nullify the skulls at least, and the elder thing. So yeah, plus one would be better than nothing. So we're gonna commit. Yeah. Well, the elder thing is minus two, right? There's two. Oh my god, there. you're right. Ugh. Can we just quit? No, we can't, because it's infested. <laughs> we can't quit anymore. <laughs> the All door right. has been shut. <laughs> okay, I'm going to investigate four to three. Four to three. Yay! Yay! Hey. So that last clue is mine. Of course, I committed my crack the case, so I don't get to get the resources for that, but that's fine. That's fine, yeah. Now I'm going to test combat to remove the sickening webs. Right? Yeah, because we mm -hmm. can't move out, so we need to do that. Yeah. So I'm going to commit my taunt to that, so I'm five to three. Perfect. That's cool. gone. That's good, because that card can be annoying. Yes. So we have four out of eight. Yeah, I think it's this location, the therapies ward that has like four, hopefully. Okay. So then I will move for my last action. I will move to there. Yep, yep. there you go. Four, and what's its text? At, when you investigate, take one horror, and then it gets minus two shroud for this investigation. That's not uh, bad. I mean, that's yeah. not fun, but also if I just get two horror, then suddenly my run for your life triggers. Um, <laughs> or is that good, at least. Okay, that's me. Okay, so this guy will ready and come back to me, which is fine. Yeah. And then try. Card. Oops. Uh, a fire axe. That is actually prime Preston. Card. 
Reckless Assault. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Give me a spider. <laughs> All right. So now we're at one of six on the agenda, and at the end of the Mythos phase, we have to do another infestation test. So I don't want to. <laughs> it's going to be all cultist. It is. Oh, and I just drew a lot No! <laughs> uh, we were moving too fast, so it serves us right, I guess. Combat agility. That's yeah, right. that's okay, my, my card is Whispers. Uh, oh, sorry. This is technically paired. Oh, uh, <laughs> I will look away. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm, I am going to choose... Yeah, I'm just going to choose willpower. I don't think we're doing any willpower tests for the rest. Not at this point. Yep, so we each get minus two dead power tests. Okay. And then our infestation. Draw the token. Draw the other cultist. Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> no! That's not right! <laughs> so, the emergency room, right? Yeah, yeah. God damn it. <laughs> Oh, Smashing my so small bad. dream. I know. Oh, okay. All right. This is just the opening part to you. This is I, know. Know. I clear the infestation, which I forgot what kind of test that, that is. I think it's power. <laughs> uh, it's. I think it's will. I think it's a double, isn't it? It's one or the other. I don't remember. Yeah. Oh, this is Garbo. Um... <laughs> okay. <laughs> God, do I even play trench coat? It's a damage soak of two. Uh, I don't know. You go first, or should I go first? I guess I don't know if it makes a difference one way. Um, I can go first. That's fine. Okay. So first, I'll get my resources. Total five. Uh, I'm gonna use Jimmy. Uh, J Jimmy <laughs> Joey's free action. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jimmy there. And pay two for fire axe. We and call him then... Joey Jimmy Vigil. <laughs> <laughs> Joey Jimmy the rat. Uh, I'll, oh, sorry. Uh, before I do that, let me automatically evade my guy. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then I'll move my first action. Nice. And then I'll pay a total of four for intel. Yes. Two. Four and grab two clues from this. Because uh, this just, yeah, cannot be investigated. Yep. Mm -hmm. I can do it through the locked door. And then I can't really help with the locked door, so. Uh, I do. I do. Yeah, I'm not getting through the locked door. Just draw a card. Yes. I feel have a feeling I'm going to be doing that a lot. Yeah, I'll just draw a card. <laughs> okay. Let's see what you get. Uh, fine clothes. Okay. okay. That done. actually might be useful for later. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Okay. Um, well, I got... Oh, this is so bad. Combat or agility. Agility would be terrible. Combat, I'm four to four. If I pitch my colt... Which I don't want to do because I think it's my only other weapon. But I want to be above. I don't want to be even. So I think I will pitch my Colt. Five to four. Aw, oh, fuck you. Negative two. Uh, Ian, this isn't going well. <laughs> I'll, I guess, four to four. Try it again. Because we need these clues. Reveal another. Yay. <gasps> Yay. I fail, so we make an infestation check. <laughs> uh oh. Right click on the infestation bag. Draw. It's going to be a cultist. I know it. Yes, it is. Ian, you're awfully quiet for as poor as I'm doing. <laughs> that is because I am checking something out and I think I have bad news for us. Oh no. 
I think I loaded the wrong deck. <gasps> Ian, what are you doing? I know. I was pretty sure it's the right deck. I think it's the wrong deck I loaded. How did? What made you realize that? Because someone in the chat said that it should be a baseball bat instead of a fire axe. Oh no! I know. What do we do? <laughs> What what time is it? How far into this shit show are we? Seven fifty six. I think we started at thirty. So, about so we're only, minutes. Ahead. That's not bad. Do we want to scoop and redo it? Uh, I'm fine with that. If okay, I mean, I wasn't feeling great about my progress anyway. So <laughs> okay, okay that, that was a test run. That was a test run. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Sorry, Nick. No, oh, that's fine. Bad. I just got to figure out how to quickly get back to a, a state here. Uh, oh, my gosh. That was dumb. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It took me a half hour just to get the stream set up, so you're fine. I think, I think the problem was um, I had two Preston decks next to each other in my Arkham DB, like um, regular Preston right above. Mm -hmm. I don't even know what Preston decks was. It was performing suspiciously well, so... <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> that probably that. should have been an indication. Another card I can use. Oh, another card yeah. I can use. <laughs> Alright. Okay, let me toss this back. I'm gonna need to and reset. now we're going to see the full power of how bad this <laughs> other Preston <laughs> deck will be. <laughs> um, flip... Flip, put us back to here. We need two more well, clues. At least I'm glad we caught that. Uh, I think that was E Martin chat who caught that for us. Because otherwise, um, if we would have put this out and then everyone's like, you used a regular yeah. deck, that would have been very demoralizing. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Deck not Deck's not found. Why is it not found? Uh, so spiders come out. Spiders, spiders, spiders. And I'm just going to put all of these. Preston Chaos. There you go. Okay. Did I really get doomed as my weakness? Oh, no. You're kidding. Did it? <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> but but I'm actually not oh. worried that that worried about it in a in a um, five scenario campaign. So. <laughs> sure. Because <laughs> in, in a in a deck full of bad cards, why would you be drawing? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna put that there. <laughs> just just put me out of my misery faster. So. <laughs> Is the is the encounter deck really only twenty one cards at scenario start? That seems low. Okay, okay. That was an example of how a Preston deck should work. Now we will see a <laughs> Preston deck that will just do absolutely nothing. <laughs> yeah, I should have known there was something in my back of my head too, because I was like, I don't remember two tribal uh, travel by fires, because that's actually a good <laughs> That's really good, yeah. That's good for Preston. Yeah, there's no trial by fires in the actual <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're pretty much doing the same start, right? We're just drawing new opening hands and yeah. Okay, okay. draw five. Sure. Well, I don't want that cover up. Okay, I do have a baseball bat, keepsake, painkiller, resourceful, and decoy. I'm gonna throw back painkillers. I'm gonna throw back resourceful. These resources out of here. This deck has Duke oh. of Esli in it? Oh my god. <laughs> I'll probably keep Keepsake and Baseball Bat and Decoy and draw two. I guess I'll hang and, on to first aid because I don't know what the fuck I'm going to draw. Okay, I draw my Intel report and I drew Oops. <laughs> yeah, this sounds more <laughs> like it. <laughs> okay. Back down to three resources. You're all set up? Yep, I'm ready to go. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um, well, uh, I guess I will... 
I better... Oh, should I put first aid? I should probably put first aid out right away, huh? We'll play first aid right away. We'll probably need it. Yeah, I'm sure we will. And then I'm gonna... You know what? I'm gonna commit Strange Solution to my Investigate check. Because even if I did make that check on it, I don't think I'm gonna be concerned with upgrading into Strange Solution... Wait, I can't even, because Roland can't take it. So yeah, fuck that. Yeah. All right, so I'm four Just to three. Straight garbage. <laughs> yeah, straight garbage. Yay, I got it. So there's one clue for me. Clue. And then I'll just try again at three to three. That's a no. And that's me. So go ahead and take your turn. Okay. Okay, good. Resources, boo, and I wish I had Joey. I actually have some items here, but I think what I'll do is start off and just do my intel report for four. We don't spend a ton of time here, and I'll grab two clues. Well, I already got one of the. Clues. Oh, you! Oh, you already got one. Okay, I so succeeded I on one of failed. my checks. <laughs> I just assume that you failed. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I failed on the last one, not the first one. Okay. Uh, in that case, I'm going to hold on to my intel report. Mm. I will pay for two for baseball bat. Very nice. <laughs> because why not? I don't think I have anything else that really takes up hand slots. Um, I'll put out my keepsake. And then, I think I'm just going to draw. Draw into my doomed. <laughs> uh, oh. Dumb luck. Okay. Ooh, the oops, oops and dumb oops luck and dumb combo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, doing so much. Okay, that's it. For okay, so we are at one of two. And encounter card. Oh, no, yeah, I've got to do my... my Regroup phase. <laughs> I drew opportunists. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I'm succeeding by three or more. <laughs> yeah, that's not fair. Unexpected courage, I'll take that any day. Alright, what do I get for the encounter card? Dissonant voices, that's fine. That's yeah, actually that's a, fine. It's a soft touch. Yep. No! Lock door! <laughs> Ugh. Slams the door in our face. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, someone break that door down. <laughs> do I do I use steadfast to break the lock door? I think I do because I think our I think our goal is just to get as much progress as we can as quick as we can, right? Yeah. Yeah. So all right. So I am seven to four. I mean, I didn't say this at the top, but I honestly feel, honestly feel our best approach is try to get as much XP as possible, knowing we're probably going to fail this scenario. Right, exactly. So, so yeah, <laughs> seven to four. Perf. God damn it, of course it shows up then. Plus one. <laughs> That's fine. Discard. Where's the discard? Roland just headbutts the door. <laughs> <laughs> And then someone opens it for me. That's what the plus one is. <laughs> so I go to headbutt it, and it opens, and I just run right through it. So that's my first action. Then I'll investigate. I am three to three. Do I ditch the courage for this? No. Let's try. A, let's try straight up three to three. Well, fuck me. Negative one. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna. I can, I, can, I can commit on this if you need it. No, I well, I'm sitting on an unexpected courage, but I'm not sure if I should save that or if I should go hard on as much progress as possible. You know what I mean? Yeah, I can put you one up with opportunity. <laughs> sure, go ahead, do that. Four to three. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Opportunist MVP. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, you're up. Oh, uh, I thought I'd gone already. <laughs> <laughs> nope. You're still in hell. <laughs> uh, okay, let me get my resources first. 
I'm gonna go use my Intel report, I think. Um should I use it from the higher shroud location? Now let me just peel it off emergency room so we don't have to worry. So I'll move there. And second action, Intel report. Oh yeah, I need to manually place the clues because we pulled them. One, two, three, four. And that's my one copy of Intel report. I'll grip Poly those two, two clues. So that's done. <laughs> Check. And then I think I'll just move to the next location. Keep trucking. We're halfway there, Ian. <laughs> yep, that's me. Okay, put four more clues on here. See what joyous surprises my deck has for me. I got my gun. Followed. Uh, that might be interesting if we actually. Oh yeah. If one of them spiders shows up and I hit it a little bit. Yeah. Although with swarm, it's weird because oh, I've not yeah. technically damage on the enemy. Yeah. Kind of okay. sucks. <laughs> Shuffle the spiders, the outbreak, and the discard pile, and do an infestation. Well, don't do it yet, but get ready to do it. Shuffle, 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 and then draw and counter cards. S sickening webs again. <laughs> I get glimpse of the underworld again. <laughs> Wasn't that the same combo as literally, last time? <laughs> literally the same. All right, now we got to do our everybody's favorite. Call Is it to. possible to shuffle the the bag? Oh, I think if you right click on it, like a shuffle or something. You gotta be fucking kidding me. No, well, this is not. Possible. Oh, and there's a damage. Oh, yeah, on we the... should have a damage. Uh, it would have been on the one with the most clues, right? So it would be this one, the one I'm on. Oh, is that where it goes? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think it's the location with the most clues when this happened. So uh, then, so then for a cultist, yeah. we're going to put it on the emergency room, right? Because we want to keep the waiting room clear as long as possible. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. Keep our options open. <laughs> okay. Um. Well, I got my gun. But I don't have anything that helps me investigate. Um, okay, so I'm going to... I'll go first. I'll play my gun. Oh, Dissonant Voices is gone. So discard that. Okay. Playing my gun. Um, for first action. Second action, I'm going to get past the sickening webs, and I'm going to commit Unexpected Courage to that. Mm -hmm. And that's combat of three, so I'm six to three. Yay, Oof. I wish that actually did something. <laughs> I love Roland, but his Elder Sign is the worst. Yeah. And then for my next action, am I coming to you or am I going up to the records office? I don't I don't feel I don't remember what the shroud is in the records office, but I have a feeling it's like a four, yeah. three or a four. I think come to me probably. Okay. That sounds good. That's me. <laughs> Uh, okay. Get my resources. I will trigger this. Take one damage and one horror to get rid of Glimpse of the Underworld. So one horror on Teddy Bear. One damage on Preston. I like to imagine that the first horror on the Cherished Keepsake is its eye falling out and like a <laughs> string. <laughs> uh, now what on earth do I do? <laughs> This is the true Preston Chaos deck. Or... <laughs> okay, I'll draw a card first action. Okay. Cunning. Okay, if I can get 10 resources on me, then <laughs> that becomes uh, yeah. three, and I could be four. That's actually. It's not bad. Yeah. It's not great, but it's not bad. I mean, I'm not great yeah. either, so. I mean, I think with this deck, there's no, like, setting up plays. It's just play what you can while you can. Yes. So, I, I think... Well... 
Um, I'm just trying to suss out the rules here. So resources on inheritance can be spent as if they were in my resources pool, but they don't count as if I have that many resources, Correct. right? We're cutting, yeah. So I'm going to spend second action to move four to me. So I'm going to be up to 11. Nice. Lots of money and nothing to spend on. <laughs> and then we're going to cunning. <laughs> Yay. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, take that horde to lower the shroud to two. Nice. That'll pop my teddy bear. And, yeah, so this should be four to two now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see what we get. Yes. Yay. Okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, that's all I got. <laughs> Every successful test feels like a like It a feels win. so meaningful. It I know. <laughs> oh, okay. There's that trench coat again. Ugh. Okay, give me something playable. <laughs> that's my criteria at this point. Uh Kukri! <laughs> 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 I forgot that card existed. I know, so did I. <laughs> All right, we're at one of six drawing encounter cards. Oh, I got night terrors. Put it in my threat area after I fail a test, which is going to happen. Oh no, this is going to suck. Uh, that's the one no, that it's I that one, remove you know. cards from the game. So I need to get Tooth of Estley <laughs> into play. <laughs> oh, gross! Outbreak, no. Okay, we gotta do an infest test. And we're at a locate. Yeah, we're at one. So each. Yeah. So okay. each tablet gets treated as a skull. All right, shuffle the bag, and draw mm -hmm. skull. Okay, so that is that's the Search enemy. Search for a spider. Yep. So go and ahead and spawn grab it at the infest. Okay, and spawn it infested near, so that's going to be at our location, yep. right? And it can engage with so, it, it's fine. Uh, let me find the weak spider, or weaker spider, the swarm. And shuffle this. Yeah, and that's going to be swarming two. Okay. Um, swarming pulls from the top of my deck? Yeah, I've forgotten this. I, technically, I drew the outbreak, but I think it should be the lead, right? Is who provides think, the swarming so. cards in this case. Yeah. So we're going to just put those there. And then they go under my deck when, yeah. when I kill them. Okay. All right. And then we still have to do a regular infest. Yep. So shuffle the bag. And <laughs> Come on, tablet. Tablet. Okay. So we're not. Okay, that's not. Bad. Okay, should I go first and just take care of these spiders? Sure. At least you can get some clues. Are you still or in? It's just a clue. disconnected. Um, I I should be in still. Okay. It shows that you disconnected. Oh, now it says that I disconnected. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's see, how can I reconnect? My computer just had enough of it, I guess. <laughs> God, okay, come on. One. I'm tempted to not even mm -hmm. use my gun on these things. Just do three to one. And, God, does... Does hitting the swarm cards, does that count as defeating an enemy? Yeah, it should. Nice, so I could get three clues. Yeah, oh, well, rolling is oh, limit once. once per round. Yeah, never mind. Yeah. It's been a while since I played. They can get a clue, at least. <laughs> yeah. I'll wait for yeah, you to get back in before I... 
Okay. Should be connecting. There you go. All right, I'll promote okay, you. Okay, back to... Yes, promote Tales from the Cards. I trust them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, action to fight. God, but Night Terrors. Like, if I test three to one and fail, and I trigger Night Terrors... Ah, uh, who cares? All the cards suck in my deck. I don't care if that goes off. Mm -hmm. Three to one. <laughs> Got it. So nice. one swarm card. How do I put this on the bottom? I gotta move my whole deck. Yeah, that's usually how I do it. <laughs> there might be a trick, but I don't know it. <laughs> right, and that gets me a clue. Yeah. Yoink. Oh, two more to go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're so close. All right. Uh, three to one for my next one. Got it. Yeah. such a laborious process and mm -hmm. three to one for my last one gosh i use a bullet just to be safe no don't do that three to one damn it i should have oh, <laughs> now night terrors triggers and that is reveal the top three draw each weakness and remove the other cards from the game one field work is gone two Vantage point is gone. Three first aid is gone. That's fine. Get out of here, garbage cards. Where do I even? We'll just put them over here. That's me. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I could try to hit the spider if you want me to, but <laughs> no, don't worry about it. I can take a damage. Okay. Because uh, then, if it's their next round, I can kill it and get another clue for free. So, yeah, that is true. That's probably our best bet for getting clues right now. Right now that I actually have because weapons, and shit. I have a big fat just nothing. <laughs> I could decoy the spider for you, but <laughs> no, don't save it. Save that it. also doesn't seem that useful. Guess I'm just gonna draw a card and see <laughs> what I can find. Some icons, maybe at least. Grizzly Totem. Okay, sure. That's... That'll actually be kind of useful. Gets you more mileage out of that kookery. <laughs> so well, I'll spend from here one, two, three. That at least doubles up my icons. Uh -huh. Um. So if I committed followed, I could be three to two, one up. Not great. But it's probably the best they can do right now. Take the whore, sure. Let's, let's try it. What the hell? So I'll, I'll put the whore on the doctor. <laughs> Here, hold this. <laughs> 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 um, okay, I'll exhaust the totem. And that's going to go ahead and double up the intellect icon. So I'm at three to two. Okay. Here it comes. Yeah! Minus one. Woo! Okay, okay. <laughs> all right, that's it. <clears throat> that's all three? Okay. Um, enemy hits me for one. Oh, yeah, I don't. I can just click the little button. Click. And then upkeep. I have two trench coats in this deck! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Chaos Generator is a big fan. So big bad. fan. There's my fine clothes. Okay. <laughs> We're at two of six. Here's my next card. Frozen in, Frozen in Fear. Okay. And mine is... Locked Door oh! again. <laughs> oh, that does, that's fine. I can I can spider my way through the locked door and get the... Yeah. Yeah, that'll actually... That's kind of a nothing. Yep. Okay. Um, we're going to shuffle the infestation bag once my screen catches up. There we go. And then let's reset the camera and then draw. Big money, big money. Tablet. Yes. Okay. Whew, everyone keep calm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I will go first. Okay. And I will fight the spider. And I am going to spend a bullet. <laughs> just because I don't want to get fucked by that negative three again. Does that not go back in? 
trash. I don't think it does. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so I am, what am I, four, five, six, seven to one. Bring it. Nice. Dead spider. Yes. And the clue. And the last clue off of that location. We can advance. Oh, we yeah. can. Let's, uh, oh God, what happens when we advance? <laughs> I think it just opens up the map. Then let's right? do it. I don't remember. Yeah. That's why I was asking, but that's fine. Let's just do it. Let's just get past this. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like we made I'm some down. progress. Let's get to those victory point locations. <laughs> <laughs> then we will get no problem. <laughs> uh, put the set aside stairwell and basement door locations into play and then make an infestation check. So if you want ah, to. Ah, really? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to get okay. those locations out, I yeah. will do the check and see what we get. I cultist. heard you like infestation tests. <laughs> so there's our second cultist. And that's going to infest, which. We could do the stairwell. Now I'm going to have Papa Roach stuck in my head. Right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, we could infest the stairwell, or we could infest the waiting room. Are we? Do we? We want to keep that waiting room open, right? Um. Yeah. Just in case we want to resign. Yeah, because normally in the scenario, you wouldn't right? You just you'd want to keep that choke well, hold, but I think in this case, normally we want we want the option to resign. Right. Well, I think even normally I would probably infest the stairwell because then that gives mm -hmm. me the option to cleanse the stairwell. And once you do that, like you can block off half the map potentially. Sure. Sure. But I guess we don't have the option to cleanse quite yet. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. we'll just infest the stairwell. That's fine. All right. So, and you have one action left. Um, God, do I test to get rid of night terrors god it's a will four but it gets rid of it no matter what yeah i'm gonna do that i'm gonna get rid of the tooth of etsley i'm gonna ditch that to test four to four oh and since we draw a second at cultist we were the token back oh right? yes thank you yeah um that's a negative i fail so i do the night terrors and then it gets discarded oh you know what i probably should have saved tooth of etsley to to uh get rid of frozen in fear but whatever that's fine say lovey Okay, cover up okay. comes out. That's fun. And then taunt. <laughs> oh, and... man. Okay, those are removed. And <laughs> mental trauma. And I have two desperate skills in here. I might just tank this trauma. <laughs> Be in desperate range more well, often. Yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. <laughs> That's me. Okay, uh, get my resources. I'm gonna move. Oh, sorry. End, ahead. end of my turn. Mm -hmm. I have to test for frozen and fear. So three to three. Oh, that's right. Fail. Okay, go ahead. Okay, so I moved to the stairwell, which is three and two clues and a victory point. Um, I can slide down the stairs, not, but I'm not going to. So. Hmm. This one says after stairwell becomes infest, make an infestation test, but it wasn't flipped over at the time, right? Right. So that would be. Yeah. Oh my god. Because do the rules say anything about you have to flip it over, infest it or something? Let me check. Real quick. Yeah, look that up. Because I don't know. <sighs> Might be one of those like little clauses in the rule. Um. No, it's not in the campaign guide. Let me look at the actual activation card. Uh, doo -doo. Huh. It doesn't say anything about flipping it over. So then I guess we infest it while it's unrevealed, and then its forced text doesn't trigger, right? That location becomes infested. Yeah, that's my reading. I don't know. Silver linings. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't see 
anything about it f***ing over, so... Well, if we're wrong, we're wrong, but... <laughs> yeah, I've been wrong before. Beat myself. I won't beat myself up too much about it. Okay, <laughs> I got two actions. <sighs> what do I do? What do I do? I can't really investigate where I don't have any intellect icons in hand. Oh... I can play my fine patient of parlaying with that Randolph. Um, or is it Virgil? <laughs> uh, it's and, Randolph. Uh, it's Randolph, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then, I guess, a draw? Did we get an intellect icon? Nope. Able bodied. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good old able bodied press. Yeah. yeah. No, no, that's me. Okay. Uh, upkeep. Crack yeah, the case. other terrible thing about this deck is the lack of intellect icons. <laughs> right. We are at three of six. Clock is ticking. Okay, okay, I got run for your life. <laughs> <laughs> uh, encounter card. I got glimpse the underworld. That's fine. Okay, and I'll draw and get threads of reality attached to the asset with the highest mm. printed cost. Which I think is going to be my Grizzly Totem, unfortunately. Yep. Which is my only asset worth a damn. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, treat it as if it's blank. Okay. Yep. And then you action discard a different asset to discard right. that. Okay. That's fine. And then infestation check. Uh, shuffle again just to be safe. And draw tablet. Nice. Okay. okay. Um, there are no clues left of my location. We can just ignore that locked door. So I'm going to move down to you. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to investigate. Oh, moving cost me two because of Frozen mm -hmm. and Fear. You know, maybe I shouldn't have committed that Tooth of Etsley. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm going to take uh, the damage from Glimpse the Un Underworld. Damage and Horror. I'm just going to take it both. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, and then I will investigate. What is this? A three? So I'm three to three. Ugh. Do I pitch crack to go four to three? Yeah. I don't need those resources. What, to get a trench coat out? Fuck me. We'll just do that. Four to three. Yay. I always succeed on that when I don't need it. Like, <laughs> whoop de doo All right, one clue. Uh, is that a VP location, or did I just waste my time? It is a VP location. Okay. It is VP, yeah. All right, so then I'll test for Frozen in Fear, 3-3. Three to three. That's a negative one. That's a fail. Go ahead. I could keep fishing for intellect icons, but I don't remember what's in the basement exactly, but I think I'm just going to forge ahead. It's uh, it's two decoy locations and one real location. Yeah, <laughs> and I have the fine that. clothes of Parley. Mm -hmm. Parley is probably like will or intellect, which I have none of. All agility and combat icons in hand. <laughs> Every yeah, same here. But let's move. Uh, I'll move to this one. Is first action and reveal. Why aren't you? I'm showing you disconnected again. Oh, that's probably why. Okay, one second. Okay, I I revealed I the location. You run the I will, I will. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> it takes an extra half hour at the beginning, but it saves us time in the long run. Yeah. <laughs> I'll take a look at chat real quick and see what we're... <laughs> Just need to play random investigator decks against scenarios generated by a random scenario generator. That would be <laughs> insane. <I'm, laughs> that sounds more fun than this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I could have played trench coat with that third action. You're not wrong, but it's getting me too damage soak which i'm not too worried about and plus one agility which i don't know when i would use that uh why would you discard tooth with two times treachery yeah i know that was a misplay 
That was a misplay for sure. Okay, you're back with us? No, not quite. Yeah, not quite. But at least have signs of life. Here we go. Seeing the tipped over wheelchair on the stairwell in uh, in the art for stairwell makes me wish that we just had more like Silent Hill inspiration in some <laughs> of these scenarios. Mm hmm. Uh, huge <laughs> Silent Hill fan. All right. Welcome back. I'm back. Okay. Let's get this train wreck continuing. <laughs> um, okay. What do we have here? Uh, two Shroud. Choose an investigator. Test. Like four, if you succeed, yeah, that's not happening. No. Uh, okay, two clues, two shroud is actually not bad, but I have zero intellect icons is bad. <laughs> I mean, realistically, what can I actually act help me? I'm just taking a quick glance. You have nine intellect icons. Yeah. Oh my god, you have, use... you have six cards in hand, and they're all combat or agility. Holy crap. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's all agility and combat icons. Yeah, I, I'm i looking through my deck, and I do not have intellect icons at all. I think like most of the intellect icons I have there in my Discord panel now. <laughs> So, I think I do not have any chance of investigating this. So, I think I'm just going to keep hunting for Randolph. Okay. The quote-unquote best of my time. <laughs> so, I'll move up here and back here. Reveal the more. Uh, of course Well, not. okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's my turn. All right. Doing big things. <laughs> Upkeep. Okay. Mind over matter? Painkillers. Okay. God, mind over matter doesn't even give me an intellect icon. <laughs> it's called mind over matter. Ugh. All right, four of six. First encounter card to me, and it is dissonant voices. That's fine. Mine is frozen in fear. Now that you found me, go. I'm never getting rid of it. <laughs> <laughs> okay all right shuffle the infestation bag and draw. also known as i hope you like having two actions per turn <laughs> another tablet Whew. okay so what the fuck do we do <laughs> <laughs> head for that resign location <laughs> i'm kind of thinking so what do we have do we even have any oh we have two victory we have points two. so far we have three, right? Where's the third? Oh, the Take stair. Care. Oh no. Uh, the emergency room and therapies ward. Yes. Right? So we have two total. Oh, therapies ward is three. three. Yep. So we have three. Take our three, three, three XP and run home. <laughs> I think maybe not quite yet, but well, we're pretty damn close. I'm, yeah, I'm thinking about it. All right. Well, I'm gonna. Should I investigate the stairwell? Should I investigate the stairwell? Ian, would you investigate the stairwell? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's VP and we're that's, one away. That's what one I was th thinking. Three to three. Nope. Oh, fuck me. It's a hard no. I'm fine seeing that tentacle out, honestly, between some of these other tokens. Like, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, true. All right, three to three. Hey! Yay! I got it! All right. More VP! More VP, okay, okay. Buy stuff for that. Now, do I start hightailing it back, or do I open up this locate? Well, no, because it's gonna. I can't move because it's gonna cost me two actions to move, so I can't move. True. So probably just draw a card. Yeah, if I can't move, I don't need to gain a resource, and I'm. I've already decided I'm not gonna worry about cover up this scenario. So mm -hmm. yeah, I'll draw a card. Okay. Knife. All right. Will three three to three for frozen in fear. Uh oh, that's not uh -oh. good. That's not good. <gasps> yeah. <gasps> Get out of here. Okay, that's me. Go ahead. 
Okay. I, uh, spend two actions just to... Okay. So I'll spend two to move. And... I could move again if I just want to open that up in there. There's only two clues on the operating room, and it's a shroud too. I kind of want to go after that. Yeah. My only problem is if I get stuck, like I'm probably gonna have this frozen in a year of the game, mm -hmm. and so let's see. I guess it would be three turns for me to get back if. I... Unless you move up into the ward now. Yeah, it's, I kind of wanted to see basement door and if I could get. Well, sure. what does what does Randolph do for us other than letting a station removal, right? Which we probably have no chance at. No, I'm uh, not. I don't think we're going to be able to cleanse anything. Yeah, so he doesn't like give us any P, right? But potentially, no, I don't think so. I think the only VP we get in this scenario is on the locations. Is on what, sir? On the locations, sorry. Yeah. Okay, so maybe it's... I will let it alone. Start heading back. Yeah, what does the records office have? <laughs> Yeah, I'm just trying to think how we even approach getting more clues here. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, I guess I'll just head up. Yeah, I think that's I think that's the best bet. Now I have to test one against three. <laughs> <laughs> I could pitch one to be two to three, which is pointless. So let's just take it. Yeah, that's a big no. Okay, that's my turn. All right. <sighs> Five resources. Draw a card. What do I get? Anat anatomical diagrams. Okay. That's an <laughs> intellect. Oh, no, it's not intellect. It's a will icon. Ugh. Ah! <laughs> What'd you get? <laughs> I drew last chance, which could potentially help me investigate, but I have like a billion cards in hand that I can't get rid of because <laughs> they're all icons and like effects that are worthless to me right now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this at, deck is terrible. This is so bad. We're at five of six. First encounter card. I get rotting remains. Oh boy. Um, well, I'll pitch that anatomical diagrams to make myself four to three. <gasps> wow. Oh my god. I got it. You're up. Or your encounter. Yeah, I, think, I think people are pointing out that Randolph boosts intellect and will, but uh, for me at least, that'll be taking me up to two each, which is still not enough to do a <laughs> damn thing, really. <laughs> so I'm, I'm okay without him. Yeah. Okay. Uh, encounter card for me? Is that where we're at? Yes. Okay. Locked door. Uh, what has the most clues? Let's it's just the, throw it on a five uh, shrouder. Yeah. Please, because I do. I'm yeah. still kind of thinking I can clear that operating room. This mm -hmm. time, maybe. Um, all right. Infestation. Shuffle. Draw. Oh my God. Okay, I have mm -hmm. to go and clear that. I have to go and clear that location. <laughs> <laughs> like this is. I have to do that. All right, so first action, move down into the operating room. And then investigate three to three to two. Oh my god. That's one. Investigate three to two. Damn it. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got one of them. The that's two one. sides of Arco. Yep. Yeah. All right, that's me. Uh, okay. More of the thrilling adventures of Preston. <laughs> uh, <laughs> God, 
God, it's like so I said in our chat earlier today, what's worse than having a deck of random cards is the deck of random cards combined with one in every stack. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And it wouldn't be that bad if I had, like, intellect icons in the deck, because mm -hmm. then I would just pitch all these cards in hand, but no intellect icon. Yeah. Uh, so what do I do? I will move to the resign location, I guess. And just twiddle my thumbs, just draw a card, I guess. <laughs> as long as we don't get anything that infests your location, we should be fine. Which is, is there anything that does that? What is, is Outbreak infesting your location? Outbreak you is you perform an infestation te test. Right. But, and, then uh, and then it treats... The infestation it. test is just connected, right? And then is it... I yeah, so there's nothing that fests your location. Okay. Unless we have gender <laughs> flips. I mean, I don't know. Yeah. I don't remember. I've played this a few times. I still don't remember all the... I can, yeah, I can also just stay put if I want to play. No, I mean... I... Yeah, just move there. That's fine. Put yourself in position. Okay, and I'll draw last action. Always a good idea. Would it be beneficial for you to resign? Uh, not to me necessarily. Maybe to you. Because I'm just dead weight at this point. <laughs> I'm just an extra encounter card at this point in the game. Kind right? of what I was thinking. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, maybe next turn I'll resign. Okay. All right. So then yeah. I'll keep. Uh, let me just do my frozen and fear test, which sure. is a big fat no again. <gasps> Ooh, I got barricade. That is icons. Upkeep. Oh my god. Agenda this is the post. most worthless hand in history. Uh, Backside of agenda two. Find each suspicious orderly enemy in play. Replace it with the set aside corrupted orderly enemies. Search the encounter deck, blah, blah, blah. Remove the suspicious orderlies. So, wait a minute. The corrupted orderlies don't... Oh, yeah, no, they do go in there. And the agents of Atalaknaka. Mm. And the discard pile. And we add a skull and a cultist to the infestation bag. Fuck me. All right, where's our set-asides? Here they are. Corrupted orderly and agents of Atalaknaka. And oh, I need to pull the the what you call it's suspicious orderlies. Do do do. Do you want to add those tokens to the infestation bag for us? Yeah. Thanks. So skull. Where's the other one? Where's the other orderly? Oh, there he is. Shuffle, 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 and watch me pull a gray weaver this time. Okay. That and station then, back should be that. Okay. And now we are we're still making the infestation tests every round and spider enemies are big. Plus one fight, plus one evade. Okay, first encounter draw, I get night terrors again. I get fine. Rotting remains. Hmm. Uh one to three. Zero to three, that's three horror. <laughs> throw one on the doctor. Uh, I'll throw the other two on myself. <laughs> it says you disconnected again. Uh, oh, gosh. Okay. That sucks. <laughs> um, so while you are gone, and since we're separated, I'm just going to take my turn since I'm just going to be sure. investigating. So. Uh, night terrors. I'll commit barricade. So I'm four to three. One up. Oh my god. Thank god. So glad I committed that barricade. So I pull that clue. So I just got us another two VP. Nice. Yeah. And then I'm going to blitz my ass back up to the experimental therapies ward. Because I'm not going to go for anything else. I think we're just, we're on our way out now, right? 
I'm going to take your silence as uh, as an agreement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I'm going to be designing very soon. <laughs> uh, catching up on chat here, Roland could use Randolph as an ally in his deck. That's true, but I think we were kind of focused on getting VP versus trying to parlay Randolph, mm. which or might not be well set up to do. Um, last chance. Yeah, last chance is in hand, and it's completely useless because I can't get rid of the other cards in my hand. Because <laughs> I'm not taking any combat or agility to, and all of their effects are not stuff I can use right now. And, okay, I should be coming momentarily. And what else? Yeah, that's the big question, Republic Life Human in chat. So Preston taking two adaptable is legal, right? Yes, it is legal. Um, here's my thinking on it. Well, going into this experience in this campaign, I said there's no way I'm doing that because I kind of view that as like a cheap way around to uh, like the chaos whole um, right, yeah, it, it, experience. It, it, mm -hmm. But but <laughs> after what I just experienced right now, <laughs> I I might be heavily rethinking that. So. Yeah, I, I think that uh, Adaptable is probably in my future. Agreed. I think one of us has to have a semblance of a functional deck after this. Mm -hmm. Matt says, uh, Wait, you have to cover it all up, Nick. You can't let people find out what happened here. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I'm going right to Rex Murphy and telling him everything that happened, including my <laughs> I don't care. Okay, I'm back. Where were we at? Uh, it's you your took turn. your turn already. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Yeah. So I, I think unless you need me to stick around, I might just resign. I think like, unless you think I mean you need, you might need a decoy from me or something. Nope. I'll only be drawing one card if it's an enemy. I have I have a weapon and I have combat icons in my hand. I don't have any weaknesses. Yeah, you can left always in my deck. take an opportunity attack if you exactly. Yeah. Okay, I'm outie. Bye. Sweet. <laughs> Resign. <laughs> Preston's like halfway out the door. You got this. <laughs> you got... That's it. Okay. <laughs> All right. I get a curiosity and a resource. And oh, uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. flip myself back over. One of eight doom. Draw my encounter card. Eight Doom. I'm never getting there. No! Sickening webs! Mm. That one's not fun. And infestation check. And no matter what I draw now, it's going to be bad, right? Because there's only three of these guys in there. Yeah. Yep. Oh, no, there's four. So I have one more Now tap. I could have helped with agility and combat. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I drew a skull. Skull is what? Spider? Enemy. Yeah. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine, guys. <laughs> Everything is fine. Um, which ones don't... I'm going to take the Spider of Lang, because it only hits for one and one. Wait a minute. Can I take the horror? Can I take the horror? What does Sickening Webs do? It gets retaliate and alert, and oh. you can't get out of there. That's yeah. not great. But I have a ton of agility icons. And that's the easiest one to evade, right? Oh no, it has alert. It would well, they'd all have alert, so that's Oh, and everything goes up by one, so it'd have a four. Uh, number of swarm. Uh okay, this is not great. This is not great. Oh, corrupted yeah. orderly. Corrupted orderly is a spider enemy. Is it really? It is. So that has the lowest evade. But that also deal. Well, is there anything that just deals damage? The swarms do, but then I'd be taking three damage, right? Because it would have two swarm cards under it? Yeah. So you yeah, it'd be three damage with each. But if I pass that sickening. Oh, God, that sickening webs is going to ruin it for me. I know. That's... I should have stuck around. No, you're fine. You're fine. <laughs> I probably could have helped you. I think I'm just going to take the Corrupted Orderly. Flip. I don't think I ever noticed these spider traits. <laughs> Neither did I. 
but that is fortuitous. Um, okay. If the art wasn't a huge clue with a freaking spider <laughs> in his face. <laughs> right. Okay, so. So. I think I need to try and clear sickening webs first. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. One, two... It's a it's a test of three, right? So I can get up to six of three. So that's what I'm gonna do. Commit mind over matter. Commit my knife. Six to three. Did it? Did it go? It didn't. Let's do it again. Minus three. I'm fine. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I'm fine. Oof. Okay, I take an attack of opportunity. It's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> uh, but sickening webs is gone. So we're gonna discard that. Yeah. That's Get my first action. Way. Yeah. Second action, I think I just move. Mm -hmm. And then I resign. Yeah. Yep. Holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we, we, we did, did it. it. We <laughs> won. We won. Uh, five experience. That's not bad. That's better than I thought that's, we that's would That's way more than I thought. Yeah, five. Oops. Five experience yep. each. Um, I have yeah. one mental trauma from cover up mm -hmm. you don't have anything we don't get our yeah I did it did it do anything and don't have it <laughs> <laughs> the first few turns i felt you and it was all yeah. agility and combat icons from there. Mm -hmm. yeah i'm definitely i think two xp is spoken for for adaptable and then uh i'll spend the other three more than likely <laughs> Yeah. Uh, wow. That was it's, as terrible as I imagined. <laughs> <laughs> that was rough, yeah. But yeah, I mean, like, we made out of it with five experience, which isn't bad. Um, yeah, we uh, resigned. Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. It's All things considered, with the decks we have, I think that's probably the best we could hope for. Right. I'm going to see what I had left in my deck because it was probably Inspiring Presence. Dynamite Blast would have been fun if it bleeds. No teamwork. No. Run for your life. Colt. Hand handcuffs. I can handcuff the spiders. <laughs> I did have a Eureka in there as well. Okay. So mostly yeah, garbage. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see. Yeah, I'm going to see what else I had. Belly of the Beast. No. Because I wasn't evading anything. Mm hmm unexpected courage could have been some icons yeah i mean there was a few there's actually a few intellect icons coming up mm -hmm. but uh not soon enough to actually have an impact or do anything right so in the campaign log just quickly looking through the resign no resolution option uh we still get that randolph i forgot randolph escapes the hospital on his own any one investigator may choose to add Randolph Carter to their deck. So okay. it doesn't matter. We still we still, we still, get him. So, yeah, that's probably a good option for you since I don't think your deck has allies. Right. <laughs> he's will and intellect, which I have decent in both. I'm not great, but... Yeah. yeah. The Doctor's Fate is unknown. Fine. And then I think the one penalty we get is we get one tally mark next to steps of the bridge for each infested location with how many? Oh, yeah. Three? Is it three? Um, I think it's three. Hang on. I was yeah, updating our yeah, campaign log. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was three. It was the two here and one, then the two, stairwell. One, two, three. Yep. Oh, no, it was four. It was four. Okay. Yep, there were... I'm pretty sure that... God, I shouldn't have deleted those. That's fine. We can always look back in the stream, too. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, we, we yeah it's do that. Good. Yeah, so step to the bridge. Okay. Um, And then... Uh, let me just see if there's other campaign business here. Resolution 5. Yeah, we get our... Da -da -da. We got our XP. And then... I think since we both each side has played now, we'll probably each do our our part of the. Uh, let's see who does the interlude. I'm trying to remember. I think it's it hits both, but I think they do it first. Yeah, proceed to. 
Oops, I put a dollar sign after Randolph Carter. What um, what were the other campaign notes for the campaign log? Uh, okay, so the campaign notes are... Um, so we have four tally marks under next to steps of the bridge. Maybe three, depending on how many we're in the best. Uh, Dr. Mahaswar's fate... And Randolph escaped the hospital on his own. And yeah, that should be it for the note. Okay. And then we will probably, both sides will do the interlude on our own. And then we'll back next time around. All right. Which means the other side better give us the cat. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> we need the cat badly. <laughs> Great. Well, Ian, that wasn't terrible. Yeah, it could uh, it could have been worse, for yeah. sure. Yeah, we we got XP. We did. We're gonna try to do some things and update these decks a little bit next time around. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And uh, oh man, <laughs> I'm just thinking what this experience is gonna be because ne up next we have. A uh, thousand sheeps of horror, right? Because we're the waking side. Oh my god, that's right. So that is gonna be fast yeah. in that one. That's gonna be something. <laughs> yeah. So are All you right. are you gonna be trying to put more like what's <laughs> what's your goal for like? Am I going more? Oh, we can talk about this <laughs> off the air too. Like, like... Uh, I mean, I think my goal is to get my deck like the first deck that I loaded. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Which is definitely getting another Intel report in there, getting some more favors in there. Trial by fire. Um, I really would like at least one copy of Lola. Um, yes, yes, yes. So that I, on those turns where I was just sitting around doing nothing, I could at least grab a clue, mm -hmm. which is something. So yeah, my I think my goal is I'm going to be leaning more toward like this deck already has so much like quote-unquote damage fighting stuff even though it's not great at it that i right. i'm gonna be skewing it way more towards clues mm -hmm, mm -hmm. well and i have more combat in mine as well so i mm -hmm. think my first path or my first route is just going to be to like get rid of some of this agility garbage like trench coat and um run for your life and replace it with probably more consistent cluing um mm -hmm. maybe another weapon so we'll see yeah yeah we'll see uh emart is asking taboo or not we didn't discuss that but i we think did. under the circumstances i would say no taboo probably. i'm fine with that <laughs> <laughs> which All means right. obviously like streetwise would be an yes. option yeah. yeah we'll see mm -hmm. alright well thanks for okay. joining us everybody um we will keep you guys abreast of when we play again um mm -hmm. which i think they don't have to go in order right like we could do all and i just the interlude is all that we'd have to do in order yeah yeah but we could technically play before they do um, mm -hmm. awesome great well thanks for joining us cool um mm -hmm. good game ian <laughs> and we'll yeah. catch, you guys. <laughs> catch everybody next time yeah, yeah.